So here is the results of our testing. This particular one right here is with benchmark powder. And then I'm going to switch over to this one. This one is the one with Varget powder. We're going to work up the Varget powder first. Now this one shows that 25.5 grains of Varget is uh, pushing up a bit. 26 seems to be moving over to the left slightly. 26.5 appears to be moving to the left slightly. 27, pretty consistent. 27.2 grains appeared to move slightly to the, to the right. So we have somewhat of an anomaly at 25.5 grains and another at 27.2, which are the extreme ends. Excuse me, I would include 26 grains as well. But we have more consistency between 26.5 and 27. After further testing between 26.5 and 27, we have derived an optimum charge weight of 26.7 grains. And now we are going to develop uh, further by testing our seating depth on these uh, 55 grain Hornaday VMAX bullets. And I'll show you those next. All right, now here's the Stevens Model 200 in 223. And we were able to measure the uh, throat and chamber depth on this rifle using a comparator type of thing here to measure. And what we've come up with is uh, this thing has 2.336 total chamber depth, the max chamber depth. And now that will give us the data that we need to move to here. This will give us our seating depths to play with. <clears throat> this one here is jumping uh, one thousandth or ten thousandths from the lands at 326, 2.326 then jumping back in 10,000th increments, 0 0.316, 0 0.306, 0 0.290, 0 0.280, 0.270, 0.260, which is Sam spec, or Sammy spec. And here are the bullets that we're using, the Hornaday VMAX, 224, 0 0.223 caliber, 55 grain. And we are now going to see what our groups do with these seated to different lengths and now we will cut into the shooting okay that's good enough it's just slightly over primer looks good we don't have any excessive signs of pressure there. Make sure we're sighted in real good. That one right there was uh, just slightly over the dot. Yep. That's looking good. We are just slightly, slightly high. One, let's see, we'll go down. One, two, three, four. That should put us right on the dot, or really close to it. Okay, so now we got our stickers. We're ready to go do our load testing. So on top we'll do the 223 loads and on the bottom we'll do the three, uh, 308 loads. Okay, so here's 
first in our test at 2.326. starting the test now that we're sighted in here we go Jumping to the next lowest, we're going to do this round robin style, going to the next one. There's two. Here comes our third, a little bit shorter. These are all stepping down by uh, one one hundredth. Or one tenth, excuse me. Here's number three. Okay. Here is number four. Number six. Okay. And here is number seven. First round of our round robin. Now we're going back to the lengthened load. Back to target number one. Four. Six. <sighs> and seven. 
good. Three. Starting back at target number one. Four. And number seven. goes those. <laughs> 